All right, guys, and welcome back to the conclusion of a very special Christmas edition of Let's Have Fun with America McGee's Grim. When we last left off, we were just about to fuck Santa shit up. So let's do it. I'll teach him to cross me with some good old-fashioned Yuletide payback. Giving really is the best part of Christmas after all. Make it disgusting. <laughs> Let's grim it. Oh, he used it again. I love it. Let's grim it, as in, like, let's grim it and rip it. When we get to discuss. Don't delay, but stomp away! Who wants to guess what the conveyor belt turns into? By the way, zombie elves, anyone? You know it. You know it, you love it, you can't get enough of it. it yeah! <laughs> Who guessed bombs? Be honest. No one guessed bombs. Alright. Make it Here we go. I'm waiting for a reason. Yep. Believe it, if you could I mean it's not too hard to imagine, but if you get hit by that, it fucks you up. It's kinda like falling in water. You can't fall in water. All right. Yeah. Yes. Ah, uh, zombie elves. Doing everything you can, but failing miserably. And open sesame. Reminds me of my so-called childhood. Dysfunctional. <laughs> One more round. Yes. Make it putrid. Now we're making it putrid. Once again, maintain patience. If you don't maintain patience, you're just going to get hit by this stupid thing. There it is. We made it. I got hit by that a couple times yet the last time I went through. By the way, the AoE that I have right now is fucking crazy. You want to see how far this fucking AoE is? Watch this. And now for the grand finale. Santa, coming to get you, buddy. Ha ha! There's that jovial tub of congealing lard. <laughs> Make it rancid. All right. Now. Wait for it, don't get hit, and don't get too ahead of yourself, because once again, you don't want to get hit by this crap. But, what you can do, is now that we have everything over here, guess who can get rid of these goddamn cannons? Yeah, fucking Q cannons, not anymore. We're going to get to repulsive, and then we get to turn the zo elves into zombies. And then we get to convert Make it dark. Santa's switch. <laughs> okay. I actually did not see that last time. Oh my god, Santa's switch. <laughs> Santa's fucking sweatshop, are you shitting me? <laughs> really? Ah, come on, convert it. I didn't get him? There. Uh oh, buddy. Oh, down for the count. Oh, oh, right in the gonads. Now that's <laughs> a slave. <slime. laughs> oh my God. Oh, everyone's happy. Now. Oh my god, 
God, it's so hard to contain myself. I know what's coming. I know what we no get to do. Reindeer tastes human blood. Me either. Let's find out. You're not seeing things. We get to bomb the fucking city. <laughs> we get to fucking bomb the city, aerial assault, and turn everything dark. Look at this. We are bombing a goddamn city. Yes! Bomb! Bomb! Blow it up! Blow it up! Blow it up! Yeah! Oh yeah! Yeah! Wait till we get over here. Oh, get a nice good effect there. A little bit right here. And finale! Ah, oh, yeah! <laughs> Finally, the Christmas presents we all deserve! Merry Christmas, <laughs> everyone! Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> yes! Amazing. Grim, you've done it again. Alright. See if we can get through the cutscene this time. Our Dickensian frolic is now properly tuned. Modern practice has hijacked the true holiday spirit from the Christmas Carol. We'll sing quite a different song. The grumpy cheapskate motivated by discomforting visions is a relic. Our Scrooge needs more than advice to make his conversion. Repent from your worthless hollow life, Scrooge. Or be condemned to die and haunt the earth, a despised and tortured ghost. How is that worse than what I'm doing now? Humbug. You jaded, friendless miser. Were you a better man than me? Hardly, but sharper, Jacob. Certainly sharper. Do you imagine your eternal punishment will be better than mine? Your burden less heavy, your suffering less painful. You've earned a gruesome end, Ebenezer. Your hard beat is recorded. If you're any use at all, show me how to erase it. <laughs> a miserable, solitary childhood added an unpleasant spirit. So, how is this helpful? How was I to blame? True, you played the hand as dealt, but this is early context for choices that you made. <laughs> Why this spirit? Why must I relive a tragedy? Money had to be made. The child's death was not my doing. We were all starving. There wasn't enough for food. Dark. Oh, and nothing for the child's proper burial? The child was dead. He didn't mind. There were other demands on my resource. Money was required. <gasps> my wife left me, too. Mm. Oh, spirit, I avoided her miserable fate. Oh, yes, yes, Scrooge, yes, yes. you avoided family and friends, and you have money, but nothing else. A noble legacy. <laughs> ah, commerce conquers all. Grasping, acquisitive, mindless consumption. This is what Christmas has become. And the wreck it has wrought, despite the hypocrisy of former days, there was potential when a juicy orange was the best possible present. Who is that overfed personage in the peculiar red suit? The new personification of Christmas. He is like a god. Pray unto him. He may or may not deliver. But all persons are expected to supplement his largesse with gifts of their own. Well, Tiny Tim singing with the choir celestial. But where are his clothes? Is decency completely dead? Hmm, yeah, Cratchit sold them to pay his Christmas debt. There'll be a little extra now that he doesn't have to feed and clothe him. The missus will rent out Tim's corner by the fire, too. All's well <laughs> that ends well. Eh, to them. 
The word is out. Your stuff is up for grabs. You've expired. And no one, if you'll forgive the expression, gives a damn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, spirit. I was going to make a charitable donation. Too little, too late. Bull feathers. It was my voodoo doll <laughs> did him in. Stuck pins in the old bugger weekly, I did. Finally keeled over. No way. I burned him in effigy daily. Most effective. Nice. Well, whatever. It's a miraculous day for all concerned. Scrooge is dead, and we're better off. Unloved, unliked, uncared for in life, he goes out the same way. Unmourned. Ah, good riddance, says I. Scrooge's <laughs> attempt to make amends takes a nasty turn when the shortage of conventional poultry turns decidedly weird. Tim's growth spurt was certainly unexpected. <laughs> Steroids, perhaps. <laughs> You're about to meet your maker, whoever that was. Is too much of a good thing worse than too much of a bad thing? A true conundrum. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Christmas should never be about material things. That's a vile abomination. A hideous perversion. Hmm. You'd think I'd like it. If there is anything to celebrate here... It's the blow against false values of the season. As for the real values, they'll have to look out for themselves. May all our stories end so well. Until next time, ho, ho, ho. Merry <laughs> Christmas to all, and to all, a good nightmare. <laughs> Oh, Grim, I love you. <laughs> uh, very nice. Nicely done. The nice dramatic fade out. Very nice. Alright, guys. Well, that is going to take care of it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you, uh, on, a, on a serious note, hope you do have yourselves a great Merry Christmas. Uh, spend time with your loved ones. But there is something to be said about how everything's kind of gone commercialism. You know, I work customer service and, you know, it does seem to be more about just getting shit than actually anything else. I mean, gifts, yeah, gifts are great, but it's kind of nice. You know, even getting gifts has become more like just how much money was spent on a gift. You know, it's like, Jesus Christ, dude, someone gave you a fucking gift. Like, be grateful. You know, that term really needs to be re... Not redefined, it just needs to be fucking dusted off and brought back into daily life. Like, it would really make, I think, life a lot better <laughs> for a lot of people. But, I'm not going to rant about that. That's my little two cents, green with grim, that Christmas, whether you believe in any of the other aspects of it, I mean, who cares, it doesn't matter, just, it's a lot different than it was when you were a child, and I think everyone can agree to that, regardless of our differing opinions. So, hope you guys enjoyed it, but I do seriously wish you guys a merry fucking Christmas. Hope you guys have a good one. Stay safe. Take care of yourselves. It's Mr. Casual Scum signing off. Later, guys. <laughs>